just going to make a recording just to say a few things. I'm going to rant, but also going to teach you a few lessons, or a lesson anyway. Basically, um, you know, I'm really tired of people chatting shit. That's one side of it, but the other side of it is like, you know, they're not necessarily chatting shit. What's going on is you misinterpret things. Um, you know, uh, if you take things too literally, sometimes you can misinterpret something. Um, you know, it's, so people aren't necessarily chatting shit, you just, uh, you, you know, don't ever take, um, don't ever take anything too seriously, like, um, in the sense of, like, uh, if I was to say, um, if you want a girlfriend, you've got to be indifferent, so you're happy if you have her, and you're happy if you don't have, if you, if you don't have her, if you take that too literally, what will end up happening is, it's actually just ignorant, because there's no actual, uh, there's only so much value to, how can I word this, you know, just don't take it too literally, because if you take it too literally, then you might, that's, that's where you, that's where you become ignorant, um, uh, you know, take it with a pinch of salt, is the best way I can, best advice I can give you, you know, um, Basically, what happened with me is, um, I was uh, I stopped contacting my ex-girlfriend because I was advised that you've got to you've got to say goodbye and move on, um, and never contact her again, kind of thing. And uh, it wasn't exactly that. I didn't exactly say goodbye, but you know. Um, Okay, I'll tell you the actual story because I'm just lying. Um, you know, I, I apologized for something, and what felt right was to just leave it, um, t to say sorry, and then just leave it at that. Just don't message her anymore. But if I take that literally, what ends up happening is you you tell yourself, okay, don't message her, don't message her, don't message her, and every thought you get, you end up just not, you know, doing it because he's telling yourself to not message her, what ends up happening is you end up self-destructing. And, uh, and so it's not necessarily the best advice. Um, you know, I shouldn't take it too literally, the advice of, like, you've got to be silent. Um, so what ended up what ended up happening for the whole for the whole today I've just not been messaging her at all. I said sorry for something I did, and then I didn't message her at all, and I ended up just self destructing every thought I got. I just denied it, and uh, then I ended up feeling like shit. I feel like shit right now. I did just message her right now. This is like the end of the day, so I did. You know, I I said a message just telling her. You know, sleep well. Um, you know, I sent a loving message. And uh, I don't need to tell you my life story, but... <laughs> um, but, um, but what happened there is I took I took the, the advice to literally of, you know, you got to be silent. And the truth of the matter is, is it's actually okay to message her again. Um, you know, to say something loving, um, but that's what happens, that's, you know, if you take, if, like I say, if you take things too literally, you'll end up, um, ignorant, and what I ended up doing is self-destructing, and now I feel like shit, hopefully I'll feel a little bit better, um, well, I don't, okay, I feel like shit right now, but I did message her, you know, so I brought some value, um, so I feel a little bit better, but 
I, I get the feeling no one's really gonna understand what I'm on about in this video, <laughs> but I'm gonna put it out anyway. <laughs> but yeah, that's just the advice I, I want to give you. Just don't ever take anything too literally. Um, you know, not even that advice. Don't even take the advice of don't take anything too literally. Don't take that too literally either. So, um, yeah, that, that's just my words of wisdom. All right, I'll see you later. Bye.